Let's talk about this painting. So this was back when I was trying to be a contemporary realist painter. And I completed this at a workshop in Philadelphia at a school called Studio in Caminati. It was the most difficult experience that I ever had in a classroom environment. No matter what I did, everything about this piece went wrong. The instructors had to keep revisiting my station to help me correct certain things about this piece. The proportions were kind of weird. The shadows were harsh as fuck, which the instructors definitely kept reminding me. By the way, don't become a realist painter if you can't draw. That was probably the biggest lesson that I had to learn because my drawing is kind of shit, which is why I paint the way that I paint now. I mean, look at the face. Look at that face. Who is that? No one's face looks like that. That's from a horror movie or something. God damn, that's terrible. I had such a hard time on this piece. I definitely went back to my hotel room two nights in a row and cried pitifully just sobbed but i finished it or a version of finished i guess looking back on it now i don't think it's as god awful as it felt at first but it was definitely super difficult and probably the only experience that i had with a piece where i was super emotional made me cry, made me feel like I couldn't do shit, and that I should quit. I did quit. <laughs> I just quit trying to paint this specific way, which was definitely the better decision because now I really like what I'm doing and it feels more authentic to me. And these types of paintings could just be for practice or learning experiences. And yeah, that's it for that.